Yosef, congratulations. In the end, that turned out to be quite comfortable, but how did it feel for you? Yeah, it was in the end, but from the beginning, I don't know what I, what I expected because I didn't know my opponent. He's very young and I saw just a few points from the first round against the Ferrer and he's pretty good. So I just was trying my best and I did a early break and I was surprised to go too, too easy in the second, but good for me. And Rudy is a guy who's had a lot of uh, media exposure this week and this was arguably the biggest match of his career. Do you think you were able to take advantage of some nerves on his part? I don't know, this question you have to ask for him because I don't know what he feel on the match and I just focusing on myself and and of course it was an important match for him but also for me because you know it's quarterfinal on the ATP and, and I'm not doing every week. And for yourself, do you feel like um, having come through qualifiers the momentum of your, of your game coming into the main draw has helped you? Yes, of course I did great match final of the quality uh, I did I played really well against the Jumbo in the first round so I took the best from these matches and I'm trying to improve to the next one and another guy who's played qualities for this event but came through as a lucky loser Tiago Montero is your opponent in the yeah. quarter final what do you think about him yeah it's it's weird to play same guy two times in the one tournament so but I already did this before but I was in a different position I was the lucky loser and now I'm more than his lucky loser, but anyway, it's a new match and we will see next one. It's different, for sure. Well, best of luck on Friday. Thank you.